my dear students now we will start uh, lecture 8 of module 4 we will look at design of gray to bcd converter so in this uh, converter we are looking for gray to bcd conversion input is gray output is bcd so what we try to do is uh, we will uh, look at the objectives then followed by how to achieve this, those objectives, we will uh, look at it. So the, um, the main objective is to convert gray to BCD. Input is gray, output is BCD. Okay. So we have seen in earlier uh, cases the steps as usual. So what is the truth table? It's just step one. So in the step one, what we try to do is input gray code. Gray code is written here. The gray code is 0, 0, 0, 0, 0, 0001, 0, 0, 1, 0, 0, 1, 0, so on and so forth is uh, okay, written here. So once the gray code is written, gray code uh, because that's equivalent number for the gray code because they won't follow the serial number like in binary code. So we need to take care of that. So I am reading the serial number uh, as per the code. Say for example, if, we, if I look at here, see it is 11, one, one, so it's 3, 10 is 2. 110 is 6, 111 is 7. So, likewise, I need to uh, look in. Okay. So, uh, everything is tabulated. This is input part. Then we need to look at the output. So, what is that output? Is the BCD code. In the BCD code, for every gray code, there is equivalent BCD code. So, BCD code is 000, 001, 01. We know what exactly the BCD code, which is defined from 0 to 9. Okay like binary only but in binary we will go for all possible combinations so anything greater than 9 in bcd is invalid so we don't care it otherwise I am this is the reason why we are representing is a dot care so we know the input we know the output and in sub subsequent uh, slides we try to look at okay how to get expression for a expression for b expression for c and d in terms of input so inputs are x y z and t so if you look at here uh, it's very clear what is that is uh, what is the value of a so a exactly i am looking for a is a function of inputs x y z and t so what are the values of a so it's a is nothing but sigma m the min terms of 12 13 then see here uh, 14, 15, 10, 10, 11, 9 and as well as 8. So, plus the don't care terms. What are the don't care terms? Are 8, 9, 10, 11, right? Then 14 and 15. This is 11, 1, 1, 14 and 15. So, in this uh, table, I have to just fill it up. 8, 9. This is 8, 9, 11, 10. Then 15, 14. What about 12 and 13? 12 and 13 are 1 and 1. This is 12. We know, right, the sequence numbering 0, 1, 3, 2, 4, 5, 7, 6, 8, 9. 11 10 right 12 13 15 14 so this is the cell indexing values right so based on this see how i got 12 and 13 because for this it is 1 for this it is 1 12 13 for rest of them don't care so for which values 14 15 10 11 9 8 these are don't get terms here that we have entered into KMM. We get expression for A. We are looking for output A. So, what values are entered? Output values are entered to the KMM. Right? So, what is the possibility? This is the maximum possibility. What it says? This X and Z and Z and T both are changing. So, no Z and T will come into the expression. So, in this, if I see here, what is fixed is x fixed, y is changing. So, I lose y. So, my expression will be x. So, a equal to x. 
this is what exactly the expression says is it not the same yes if i look at x and if i look at the y a both are same right so this is what exactly we got it next what we try to do is we will look for b and c solutions for b if at all you look at it is one for this is one for how many what are the exactly for which inputs inputs term 6 7 5 and 4 so i need to go to the corresponding cells 4 5 6 7 so where is 4 5 6 7 this is 4 5 6 7 right what about the rest of them here is don't care don't care don't care don't care don't care and don't care so can i take like this this four this four combination to get expression for b so what is expression for b is it not x bar y so this is nothing but x bar y okay so now look at the c for c what are the values we have it is 1 for 2 and 3 so this is 2 this is 3 you should be able to write into the k map without even without the cell indexing but if you are not comfort enough then you can write the cell next 0 1 3 2 okay 4 5 7 6 then 8 9 11 10 okay then 12 13 15 14 what are the don't cares that we have 8 9 11 10 14 and 15 for where it is 1 look at the uh, what exactly I am looking for? I am looking for C. So C is 1 for 3, 1 for 3, for 2 it is also 1. Then it is 1 for 4 and 5, 1 for 4 and 5. So can I do anything here? Yes, I can combine these two with this two, right? Can I combine these two with any other two? Is there any other possibility? No other possibility. So I can combine only these two. So what is the expression for this if at all you want to look in this is x bar y in this what is common is z common and z is same t is gone because t is changing so this is x bar x bar y z bar y z bar because z is zero what about this two in this and in this what is common is y bar so for this the expression will be y bar right from this two and from this two what is common from this two one is one common but uh, uh, this is so this is z so it is z y bar whereas this is uh, x bar y z bar so the overall expression will be this is uh, x bar so the output for c will be will be c is nothing but x bar y z bar plus okay y bar plus z okay so this is c what about d so now look at the d d is equals to 1 d is equals to 1 for 1 so in 1 you press you give 1 for 2 it is 1 so for 2 it is 1 for 7 it is 1 for 7 where 7 will come here 7 will come 7 is 1 for 4 it is 1 for 4 it is 1 then uh, is gone next for 13 it is 1 for 13 it is 1 where is 13 12 sorry so what is where is 13 so 13 will be here 12 13 and rest all are don't care don't care don't care don't care don't care don't care is there any possibility to combine the things Yes, of course, wherever is possible, you can combine them. Wherever is not possible, you can leave them. So, what I can do is I can combine these two. Possible. I can combine this one with this one. Possible. I can combine these two. Possible. Okay. Anything more? Can I combine this one with anything? Nothing is possible. Can I combine with this one? Yes, it is possible. So, based on this, you can write the expressions. Say for example, if for these two, what is the problem here? 
zt here it is y so y zt this is the expression what about this expression this expression is in this two what is common in this two is y bar so y bar and what is there is is z t bar z t bar so two expressions learn what about this one is it not x bar y x bar y z bar t bar yes this one this expression okay so this is being done then what about this expression so if i take this one what is the expression over here In this two what is common is x and this it is z bar t. okay so what about this two what about this two in this it is y bar so for this it is y bar y bar then what is common is z bar t so if you put them together your overall expression so what is that is y z t plus z y bar t bar plus then what exactly x z bar t plus y z bar t plus a final term last term x bar y z bar t bar okay so this you know already that if you know the billion expression how to get a circuit diagram so the step 5 is getting circuit diagram. as we have seen number of times so we have to re recollect all the expressions that we have got it use and or logic and one can for a directly there is no circuitry for b it is x bar y for c it is x bar y z bar plus y bar z and whereas d is okay couple of terms are there it is a and or logic circuit one can uh, draw this circuit just i am leaving to yourself i will stop here